All right, so welcome back again. So in the previous session, we saw how to work on deploying our app, right? Then we had a simple mistake, a simple error, right? So the simplest way is just build your app, you put it on GitHub, then you deploy. But when we added the button, right, we got this 404 stuff. So let's see how to fix this one for future, right? So I just go back to the same app that is already open. So the most important thing that is supposed to be main, right? The main repository and then the app, right? So I just copy the entire stuff. So the other one, I just copy the half of it but let's copy the everything and i just come back to my github repository here so i'll make the modification inside my file so i'll just put it here so that's the basic thing so paste in the entire link to the app so i just paste it here perfect and i'll save it then i'll push it to github if i check it back again so get status so the one i made uh, here right so i'm just going to add this particular one so get commit let's add first add the readme then get commit dash m let's see let's give it something like face 404 then get push right that is all so this is trying to help us fix it okay, so i've already pushed it there so if i go back and i check it again so hopefully it works right it will give us an error we try it again and then fix it perfect so now if i click on this voila it said now it is working right so the mistake we made in the previous tutorial was that we do not give the full part right so this is going to work perfectly for us so it is working perfectly well so if everything is successful we're going to see the balloons right perfect so our app is working as expected so that is a big understanding so the fix for this error that we got in the previous tutorial is that you just have to give the full part right so we are using main that is the main branch of your app so in case you have several versions on your app so let's go back and check it out so in, you know that if you go if you have different branches right then you select a particular branch right so that our own is the main branch so that is very very important right so you can just do it like this the simplest way this particular one here right so it's the main then the app then you're going to put that one as this place so everything is going to be the share.io your repository your username right then the sub repository main that is the branch then the app.py file right so that is how to face that issue so thank you for watching the tutorial if you have any question or contribution you can just put inside the comment section below and then you can also do some other stuff right in case you want to see manage the app you can just click on the manage the app then it's going to come like this so you can see the basic the logs of what whatever is happening within the app right so thank you for watching see you another time stay blessed bye